The 80th Sisters Rodeo is canceled for the second straight year. Good evening, I'm Lee Anderson. The event typically brings in millions of dollars to the Sisters community. Noah Chast has more on what this cancellation means. The last time I was here at the Sisters Rodeo grounds, I was talking about filled stands and pack lines. Unfortunately, this year it seems like these chains aren't going anywhere. The 80th Sisters Rodeo has been canceled again. The event normally sparks the busy tourist season, and Molly Weimer, who owns Sisters Meat and Smokehouse, knows that. It just brings a ton of people to town, and we, and we feel it. We see it. After the past year, Weimer is confident her business can make it through another summer without the rodeo. That doesn't mean it won't be tough. Well, I think for us, we just feel for the community. It hurts everybody. Rodeo queen Mary Olney has been waiting since 2019 to represent Sisters. Man, it was just down to the last wire, but... We're so determined to make it happen and everyone thought it was going to happen. Some things just, they don't turn out, but I feel like everything happens for, for a reason. Only has graduated high school, completed welding school, and started a full-time job since she was first selected as Rodeo Queen. There's sorrow, of course, but not much because that just gives us more and more time to make it even better. Weimer is trying to be as optimistic about the upcoming summer. It's not stopping people from coming, it's just slowing people down, I think, getting where they want to be. While it's not preferable, Weimer and Olney say they completely support the board's decision to cancel the event. Both are looking forward to next year for what Olney called the biggest, biggest little show in the world. Don't you worry because the third time is a charm. It's going to be bigger and better than ever. In Sisters, Noah Chast, News Channel 21.